Hello everybody and welcome back to Hunter Call of the Wild and we're back. I just teleported down to Beaumont Lake. That's where our new mission is. We need to harvest an animal down from at least 75 meters away in Beaumont Lake. This is our tent we dropped in the first few episodes. And I hunted here some on multiplayer and I bought this blind. And our hunting pressure's nearly gone here. So I'm thinking we, uh, I change the time to 4 in the morning. We'll work our way to that blind and call in the morning when the sun comes up. And let's do it. I got some moose scent. We got our 7 mil. We got our solo kin. And we have our 22 for plinking away at jackrabbits. This was heavy with jackrabbits. I don't want to dally too much. The main goal is to get my first diamond. Diamond challenge, personal challenge to get my first diamond at least try to so we need to make good shots on good animals I'm flirting with it I don't know if I've quite found high enough rated animal we need a five or a six I think I can't wait to get that trophy rating boy that should really make us more efficient hunting bigger animals That's how it is now. They got pretty huge racks for pretty low levels. A nice coyote would be great for our trophy lodge too. Alright, there's your blind. Guess that settles it. No wonder the black tail's on the run. Gotta give Hope some credit. His suspicions were right on target. Thanks for keeping a lookout. All right. Hey there. I think it's time I told you about Jonathan Trampfine. He heard of your dealings with black bears in Belmont, so he wanted to know if you might help him out as well. Trampfine loves black bears. He's been living out here on the reserve for many years, getting as close as he can to the bears and documenting them. A little too close for comfort, if you ask me. Last couple of days, he's been trying to get a picture of a group of black bears that just arrived this season. He's had no luck, though. He wondered if you would take a swing at it. He'd pay you, so it might be worth your trouble. I mean, we had to take photos of black bears. Harvest coyotes in Chila. All right, we got some new missions. We'll get in the blind and maybe look into them. I don't even know where to begin with Jonathan. He probably feels like he's becoming one with nature out here. And I can understand that, of course. But he's walking a fine line. And I worry one day he might find himself on the wrong side. You better be carrying a seven mil magnum with him. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. You've probably come across a coyote by now. We have a sizable population in the reserve, but the wildlife varmint control are constantly trying to keep it in check. Fiona Voiles is their operator in the area, and she's your go-to when it comes to the coyotes in this region. They could use some help with the population control, and there's good money in it, too. She wanted me to let you know that Chila Pass has seen an increase in coyote sightings lately, and that they're offering a reward to anyone harvesting coyotes. I think you'll need a coyote collar for this one. Roger that. We got a coyote collar. I 
I think I hear one already. Coming into Bav's loving embrace. Sun will be coming up soon. Wish I had a cup of Joe. I'm gonna put my coffee machine on right now. Bang. Not a very good one. I'm not going to keep it. It's only a bronze. We got the coyote mission. Oh, we got the 75 meter one already. All right, that's done. We can just call to our heart's content here. We got to go to Chila for the coyotes, so maybe next week. There's a lot of pressure up there, though. But there was a nice yodi up there. But I started following the news for the game. I guess I have to if I'm going to do series on it weekly and true racks is coming out soon so if you have any big animals you've been eyeing harvest them up and get them in your lodges because they're going to when they implement the true rack system 2.0 it's resetting your animal populations Belmont we have to go to Belmont and track three different black tailed deer that's nothing Harvest a white-tailed deer and earn a quick kill bonus of 100. That's not a big deal. Our story missions are up here. Tramp line, we have to take a picture of some black bears. Two different black bears. And Chila and harvest two coyotes. For Fiona Vaulas. Not Latin. I'm just a lover like one I don't even really scout on my single player map if I play when I'm not recording I've been playing in Hirschfeld or I've just been playing in multiplayer which means the populations are all different but you can kind of You're okay, little lady. Warning call on me, girl. Moose spray. I got moose urine on me now. I'm indetectable. Man down. Yeah, it's only a one. Ooh, leveled up. Let's get in the blind. Oh, we got a skill point. We did level up. Level 24. I'm going to have to go to Ambusher.
down. Hey, shooting bath. That looked like a pretty healthy deer right there. Whew, I got the old heart pumping. What do we got here? Only a silver. Uh, second shot must ruin the... Ruin it. That was only a three, thank goodness. Probably did not need to make that second shot. So I'll show you what we did there. We did the one we talked about last episode. Reveals information about approximate trophy weight rating and weight of the animal. So we can try that out as soon as we get an animal in sight. Get the binox out. We got any other blinds here I wonder. Wonder if that's a blind maybe we'll make our way there we'll come around here today open that that'll be our next phase of the day all right let's get out of here I can't take it any longer and we burned up a pretty good heat mark on this map just want to spot something Try my new skill out. Ooh. There we go. Trophy rating 52 out of 100. I don't know what that number means. Ooh, looks like need zone. Roosevelt Elk. Did not know we had them down here. There we go. Need to get those laser, laser range finder binox. I really don't know if that's even within firing range. Ooh, all right, all right. That one frickin' bull moose there, or elk. Drop. See what that shot was across Belmont Lake. Maybe that'll teach me. That was full zoomed in. It was still pretty small. I'm thinking that was over 200. I aimed high. I'm pretty sure I got it. I don't know how well. We got it, because there's a death spot on the map. That looked like a nice rack on him. That's why I took that shot. Didn't seem to be great territory to try to sneak up here.
is that that male? Yeah, cause that female's up there. Nice, we probably got a good score. He didn't last long. I don't know if he was big enough for a... Ooh, I got a lot of drop on that. How'd he die so quick? That was a silver still with zero quick kill. That's a... Uh... One forty-seven trophy rating. That seems pretty nice. I'm gonna taxidermize it. We'll try to call. Try to call those males back in. Double long dip. There's those frickin' elk still. Ah, blew it. Got ammo in you, yes. God dang it. Reload your weapon. I think I missed him. He moved. Not very big though. That one seems even smaller. All right, I'm feeling better. Feeling better about my misfire. Try to call him in one more time.
got to grab that dough still too I just forgot all right I need to relax this is getting too intense Go down. There it is. Ooh, it's a nice spot here. Horrible bath. Let's find that dough we gotta clean up and then let's skedaddle. It's getting late and I do wanna open up whatever that is. On the other side of the lake where we set our first landmark. Here's this dough. That was a good shot, Bav. Let's see what we got for deer or bear. This is where that antler drop was. I think it was a totem pole. It looks pretty cool. Heart was a little higher, right between its shoulders. It's a silver common ah we don't need that we need gold bears I have no idea what I just completed. Find three footprints of three different black tailed deer. Oh, and we're in Balmont now. Alright. So a lot of them are just little side missions. Female moose over there. Ooh. Bull moose.
didn't look that big, but hey, going away present. Ah, he's not hurt very bad. He's, he's dead now, though. And there he is. Yeah, he wasn't that great. Nice little snapshot though, Bav. I think this could be a really nice blind. Let's do it. Just so we have one on each side of the lake, we can hunt from one to the other. To build these, you come around to the back. In 2100, I believe that means it's an elevated stand. Yep. map we send some out we took out a bunch of bucks so that should be good what I'm thinking I should do though I'm putting the tent down so I can hunt in another region because I believe after watching this hunting pressure really only goes down in a significant way if you're hunting outside of the region Look at all those need zones we found though. Oh, we're doing good. I could have swore we found an elk zone in there, but oh well. Alright, let's hit the trophy lodge. And then we'll start back here next week. Unless we go to Hirschfeld. Not sure if I want to jump around at all. If anybody has an opinion, let me know. That was a pretty successful hunt. We've been recording for about an hour and a half, so. That was pretty fast action. All right, here we are back in the trophy lodge. What I'm wondering, we got these small ones and these medium ones. I wonder if deer can go on there. No. Medium platform. I can't put a freaking black-tailed deer on it. This one won't be staying for long. It was a nice looking deer though. Well there you go everybody. There's our first is that a black tail? That might be a white tail. And our first black tail to go with our elk. Beautiful. Alright, everybody, I hope you liked the episode. It kinda was pandemonium. Man, is there a lot of freaking animals in my map on Belmont Belmont Lake that's crazy next time we go back there though we're going for trophies only hopefully we took out some of them threes and they will go in at fours we got a four hopefully it goes in at a five and we got something to shoot for but okay everybody please like and subscribe and be sure to comment on anything you want to know or want to tell me as you can see I need help and I don't like cheating to learn so if you guys tell me it's more like learning from friends or in the bar that seems more realistic all right everybody have a good one i'm gonna go back out and hunt a little bit more